and gentlemen, and as always, thank you for watching. Uh, today, Mike was called out by the Missouri State Highway Patrol, or we sent Mike out, uh, for a vehicle off the roadway on a two-lane highway down in a ditch. Mike called back and said that uh, he needed this truck because the vehicle had impaled itself on a fence. Uh, he sent me pictures and it appears as though the fence post is sticking up through the hood between the, uh, well, somewhere in the engine compartment. So. Sorry, Leanne was uh, notifying me of something there. Anyway, the vehicle has impaled itself or been impaled, however you want to say it, by a fence post, and the fence post is sticking through the hood, and Mike, it's too far away, Mike can't get it with a rollback to be able to lift it. And since it's on a two-lane road in the middle of a curve, they'd really prefer that we use this truck this may be a job that we don't get paid for. There are quite a few of those, but I don't know what will happen. People might have full coverage insurance, might not, don't know, never know, but regardless, we're called, we have to get the job done. Whether we get paid or we don't, it's irrelevant. We have to do the job. So you gotta take the good with the bad, just like everything else in life. running code because this is not it's not blocking the roadway there's nobody trapped I know people have asked about some of the uh, code response videos they'd like to see more of them I haven't really had a lot of them recently which is which is good I mean uh, I don't like seeing people hurt I don't like seeing people trapped uh, we just we haven't had a lot of code responses recently of course it's been hot and dry so there haven't been a lot of wrecks either. Fahrenheit on its way up to around 100. 
too, but there's a lot of farmland. We've also got the Mississippi River and a river port. Uh, we have two major rail lines that run through the area. Uh, one of them runs right through Scott City. We have, uh, oh my goodness, a major pipeline that runs through the area. Fuel pipeline, petroleum pipeline. There's one of the tanks coming, tankers coming from the, one of the pipelines. Pipelines out that way by the river. And there's another one up in Cape. Watched any of my motorcycle videos? One of the rides we took was 
curves out here on this road. There's a lot of curves on this road, so there are quite a few car accidents out here. Kind of unusual for one to be impaled by a fence, but this be <laughs> be interesting to see anyway. bud. Right. You need to cool off, man. You need to cool off. I know Terry very well. He just sweat like crazy. Now let's see what do we have here. solids the ground here seems pretty good well it rained yeah a lot yeah that thing that I'm just got down here look at that oh my goodness right through there wow I thought maybe it was just a bumper cover but I reached in there and it's, it's metal in there uh no <laughs> evidently it went all the way there and slingshot it back or something. I got really? The way back. I can see the tire prints out right there. Oh, sure can. Wow. The post it grabbed a back. hold of it and did like a horseshoe. Uh, when you ring a horseshoe, that's what it did. Bit, it yeah. grabbed a hold of it and spun that thing around. Sure did. Oh my goodness. Um, roof's already caved. Yeah, that's what I think. Roof's that's already really caved. Good. We might as well just strap the dead gum thing and lift it up out of here. Get it. Do it quick. Do it quick and get it out of here. Ten foot, is that big enough? Yeah, we'll just grab it with both lines, both lines, one on each side, like we've done before. Let me get a little bit, a little bit off the road. Uh oh. Trooper is going after him, somebody. Winches. 
people ask if you can do multiple functions at the same time the answer is yes it will slow down the hydraulics a little bit but you can do multiple functions all at once okay we don't need anything except this passenger side out and no more than that car is going away we don't need much Probably wouldn't have to put the outriggers out at all, but all right. You want to go up? I'll get this set up. Go up and get turned around, yep. and come in. Yeah, just pull in right here behind me. Yep. Stick right on it like you have in the past. Yep. We'll just set it right down on the deck, buddy. touching there darn it all right like I said we don't won't need much for just this car but still want it there for stabilization If we were doing a heavy lift, I'd have to put all kind of cribbing under there. But we're not, so I don't. All right, girl. Let's get fired up and go. Darn it, I should have already sprayed myself. Better late than never. Again, it's chick, or little, ticks and chiggers, mosquitoes, they all love me. Oh, need to unlock my boom. Unlock. Fold that back up so Mike can get in close. Well, no, he'll be backing in, so he won't need it that much. We'll fold it up anyway. I wonder if anybody was hurt. Airbags deployed. Anyway, um, I was always, always asked for prayers for everybody involved. I know I have viewers who don't believe as I do. I fully respect that. Uh, your well wishes are uh, greatly appreciated. I don't expect people to believe as I do. I'm not trying to push my beliefs, but for those that do believe, I ask for prayers. this over to you pull me some slack down I didn't want it to hit my uh, the hooks to hit the side of the bed I and I couldn't reach it without grabbing a pole that's good thank you sir this poor old 
car. A little, little blood on top of that door panel there. Is there? Yeah, not much. Oh man, did, did you hear how occupants were? I did not. Did not? Alright, hey, be careful there, dude. Careful, careful. Wow, there's one heck of a drop off on the other side. It is. Wow, I didn't see that. That's why I didn't go that way. <laughs> My goodness. Right over top of your head. Hey, where's your hard hat? You ran off without it. I know. Left in a hurry. I go with you the other day. Did that one. Yeah. I'll let it slide this once. Just watch your head. Got her snugged up. Hey, look, guys, put that fence up here. Good job. Yeah, that fence held up real good, didn't it? <laughs> Come on, girl. Who knows how deep that pose, huh? Come on. You know what's going to happen. It's going to break free. There, ah, there we go. I just need to boom out and get a little bit different lift on it. There we go. Oh, beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Got it. Yep. Stay out from under. You know, you know the drill. Let me slide her back. I don't know that a rollback would have got that. What? I don't know that a rollback would have got that unless no. you cut the cut post the off, post yeah. cut the post off, and drag it with it, and cut the fence at the same time. back just a little bit. Yeah, come on back a little bit. It'll roll forward some as I let it down. That's good. Hydraulics in? Yeah, hydraulics. hydraulics are in.
tire down. I'll get everything else. On. I'll get my truck. You take care of this. Uh, just, okay. just toss it off the back. Yep, be good enough. Roll the carriage forward. Try to clear this road. Thankfully, there's not, not a lot of traffic right now. All right, change my winch speed. straighten this out when I get back up to the shop. Oop. Hang that back up. Alright. You about good, Mike? Got yours good? Yep. Scared to put that block up for me? Yep. And I'll be good to go as soon as I get that outrigger stowed. Uh, did Trooper Spain give you anything? No, he's sitting right there. Okay. I'll go up and turn around. You want to stop and check, check with him? Just set it in there. We'll straighten it when we get back. Yeah, I know it. I got to go through and straighten everything up. I got too much stuff. It's like what I was doing with the rollback earlier. Yeah. All right, bud. All right, go through and see if we can help Mike get unloaded. I know a lot of people wanted to see the full video again, so we'll go back and, well, he just about got it. You don't need my help, you just about got it. Oh yeah, it's all good. Boy, that thing's in rough shape, ain't it? It is. I didn't really, really realize how bad a shape it was in. Yeah, you can't really see this side. I was more concerned about getting it loaded and getting out of there. 
NBC shut the road down for me. Well, I turned into Burgers, oh, yeah. uh, Burgers Farm there, and turned around. Uh, the first one went past and went sideways, and then uh, the engine, Terry, with the engine come up behind, shut it down, let me turn around, get back out. Ah, yeah. uh, I love those guys. Thank you. All right, let's get this thing unloaded. Uh, You're good. guys there she sits hopefully the uh, people were okay again and like I said we'll ask for my believing gears to for prayers everybody else non-believers whatever belief you have belief system you have non-belief uh, your well wishes good thoughts are greatly appreciated as always thank you for watching and God bless